You're not going to get anywhere if you keep acting like this. I can't even look at you right now. You're an embarrassment. Imagine you see life through a camera, and for some strange reason and without any explanation, you threw away the instructions, and now you have no idea how to use any of the buttons and switches. Everything can get overwhelming really fast, and maybe when you're overwhelmed, you curl up and tell yourself things that you never used to. Eventually all these things get the best of you, and suddenly everything just seems so negative, all because you can't seem to get the perfect picture you've been waiting for. Nothing is in focus, and your vision is blurred. Of course that adds to how depressed you're feeling. And one thing turns into another, and now you're in a world of negative emotions that only seem to worsen as time drags on. You never tell yourself it's going to get better, yet you wonder why you can't stop feeling like this. You tell yourself that one day you'll die and there's nothing you can do about it, and that soon enough the age of 80 will come spiraling towards you and you will have not done what you could have done. Watch where you're going, what's wrong with you? You have never gotten the perfect picture because you gave up trying to figure out how to work the camera. It'll feel like your life would have just been a waste. Look at what you're wearing. <coughs> Ugly. Look at what you're Idiot. wearing. Loser. Ugly. Idiot. Loser. Look at what you're wearing. Look at what you're Ugly. wearing. Ugly. Ugly. Loser. Idiot. And you tell yourself that nothing makes sense and there isn't a point. There was never a point. It is okay to not be okay. And I don't know how long you'll feel like this or what actions you'll choose to take. At some point, you will find a way to cope. Depression usually results from a combination of recent events and long-term or personal factors. Second only to accidents, roughly 4,000 people die prematurely each year by suicide. It's among the leading causes of death in 15 to 24-year-old Canadians. A blank start with someone who knows nothing about you. A therapist, psychologist, social worker. Someone who doesn't even need to know your name. I mean, these people do not just exist for the sake of existing. Once you accept what is happening and realize either fully or not at all what you're dealing with and being affected by, help is possibly the best thing there could be for you. Like I said, help can make a difference to 80% of those affected, allowing you to go back to family dinners and laughing at the class clown and just enjoying yourself. The most important thing is to recognize the signs and symptoms and seek support. Once depression is recognized, help can make a difference for 80% of people who are affected, allowing them to get back on their feet. Hey, what's up? Let's do something. Oh, come on. You gotta check this Maybe out. not completely, but even just a small bit of your old self given back to you is enough to say that it helped. And maybe just another way of looking at things. Maybe using the preset focus given to you when you bought the camera, you can find ways to get amazing pictures and capture amazing things. Yeah, I mean, maybe you'll need to get creative, but that in itself can help you solve your problems. Signs and symptoms of depression include behavior, such as not going out anymore, not getting things done at work or school. Feelings of being overwhelmed, frustrated, and sad. Thoughts that it's all your fault, you're worthless, life's not worth living, tired all the time, weight loss or gain, trouble sleeping. Changing your mindset and the way you approach the problem momentarily could fix everything so easily. And do not think you can't ask for help. Help is always there, it just takes a few words to pour out of your mouth for you to get it. Someone walking down the street could come along and just help you figure out what button to press. What is right and what is wrong? Hello. Nice day, isn't it? You will find something that will help you find your way. Something that will take your mind off the pain and the worry that will never be able to get that perfect picture. Whether it's stopping on the street to pet a dog or dancing in the rain, working out painting or just walking through a park on a bright sunny day. I mean, sometimes, even just cooking yourself a nice meal can make you feel like the world is yours and you are something even when you felt like nothing hours before. And maybe it's time for us to speak our minds and ask for help. Maybe after that, we can all finally start to understand how big of an issue this is to so many people. Mental health, Mental health plays a much bigger role than it seems to. Depression isn't just something we can get rid of. Fix our minds, adjust our thinking momentarily, adjust our focus. Because when life gets blurry, we have to adjust our focus.